It's October in the Kern River Valley, and there are several Halloween events coming up, both for fun and for spooks. Because up here, you never know who might be lurking right behind you. In the Kern River Valley, I'm Corey O'Leary, your neighborhood reporter! For scares, Kern Valley FFA is again putting together their haunted barn. Last year, it was a hit. And I had an opportunity this year to get a behind the scenes look at the students putting together the barn. It takes weeks of preparations for the students to transform the barn. It's opening on Thursday, October 31st and features a less scary version for the little kids that start at seven. It will also be open November 1st and 2nd. Now for fun, I had a chance to check out this year's Bootacular Fun Run Obstacle Course Challenge. Hey, stop messing around, let's go. The obstacle course is presented by On Point Gym and aims to provide the Kern River Valley community with a fun and active event. Emphasis on the active. When Danny and I moved into town, we had this dream. It's part of our business model that we wanted to bring in events and um, just things to bring families together. Tanya Torgel owns On Point Gym in Wofford Heights with her husband, Danny. Last year, they put on the first ever Fun Run obstacle course. Like 80 contestants. We had almost 120 spectators in the stands screaming for their favorite athlete. The fastest man and fastest woman get a $250 prize, and the fastest team gets a $500 prize. And the money made goes to a good cause. Sarge's Reefs for Vets is benefiting this year. All ages are welcome. For kids that are five years and younger, we have a pumpkin run, and that's free for the kids. To sign up, you can go to the Kernville Rodeo Grounds at noon on Sunday, October 27th. <laughs> Over at the Art Association, volunteers are working to put together their haunted maze. It's going to be an incredibly great time for whoever comes. We've got a maze that you go through in order to enter the building, and then we're gonna have music for dancing, Chris Buffalo Folsom is the president of the Kern River Valley Art Association. We'll also have a kids uh, costume contest. The event is taking place Saturday at the Community Arts Center located at 6709 Wofford Boulevard. It's the big red building. We would love to have everyone. And finally, the first ever Lake Isabella Haunted Float is taking place here this weekend. It's at the main dam boat launch at Lake Isabella and people are gathering here at 9 a.m. on Sunday. So wear a costume and grab your kayak or stand up paddleboard. In the Kern River Valley, I'm Corey O'Leary, your neighborhood reporter.